outside yeah, garage yeah. sale, yes. So what did you say about it? Uh, it's, uh, everyone is coming, uh, it's a uh, different, different collection. What did you say? Uh, I'm super excited today because we have the third garage sale of Seems for Dreams. We had two garage sales last year, the first one with Vogue, the second one with Moe, and now the third one with Butter Events at Olive again. And uh, we're super excited because we got so many fantastic donations by designers, celebrities, uh, movie costumes, stage costumes. In fact, let me show you some. This is our um, upcycled fashion line. It's our first fashion line by Seems for Dreams. These are clothes which uh, were donated and had like a small error, uh, maybe like a hole or like a stain. And uh, our team has made them into a new collection of new clothes. So it's old made new, it's really cool. We're selling it only at 1,500 rupees for people to get to know upcycled clothes. And uh, in fact, I have a lot of these clothes myself. Oh, wow. And, <laughs> and um, which one is your favorite? Because so lots of, course, of different, these are like different the, the most ex expensive oh. ones. It goes up to eight thousand. Mm -hmm. But uh, here you find like fully embroidered stage costumes. This actually was uh, donated by Sophie Chaudhry. Oh. It's one of her fabulous outfits she wears on stage. So if you want to look so sexy like Sophie, wow. then you can come and shop these amazing outfits here. Uh, there are lots of first-hand don uh, donations by designers as well. This is from Narendra Kumar. Um, yeah, we have like from Rockyas, there's uh, Manish Malhotra, Gavin Miguel. We have lots of uh, really nice donations. Even Anita Dongre has given beautiful clothes. Um, we have different celebrities like myself. I think most of my closet is now, it seems, for dreams. <laughs> um, Eli Avram has given a lot. Um, we have from... Aduna actor, just a lot of like really cool clothes, um, really exciting. Lots of models, in fact, donate to us too. So if you want to have like or stylists, fashion stylists, we have lots of fashion stylists who donate to us. So if you ever wondered, you know, what the girls behind Vogue wear in their personal life, you can find it here on our racks. And uh, this time we've made it a little bit more uh, boutique-like. So it's less clothes, but more high-quality clothes. Um, because in our first year we realized that the garage sale itself um, is a more high-end um, event for our, even for my fans, everyone can come and shop because it starts at 1,500, but the clothes um, are such good quality. And uh, then we do a lot of pop-ups uh, during the year as well, like at college fest, at designer events, and uh, there we sell like even uh, more casual clothes. But right now we have more of couture, we have more of movie costumes, we have a whole rack actually, like which has a lot of costumes that were used in the movie. Um, you can even find like costumes from item songs and all. Yeah, we do have also uh, one, two outfits from Sandy Leone, but uh, I'm not going to show you which one. <laughs> yeah, her stylist actually donated them to us. We have one outfit also, which was worn by Deepika, Deepika on the cover of FHM. Yeah, uh, Kresha Bajaj, the designer, she donated it. So that's really cool. We have a silent auction on this because. I would say that's probably like our coolest outfit of tonight. Um, so that is a silent auction. You can put your bid on a paper, put it inside the box, and whoever has the highest bid at the end of the day wins. Yes, and yeah. I you said that lots of designers, lots of celebrities donate on uh, different different clothes. Yes. What's your feeling? What did you? What's your feeling? I have, my feeling is I want to buy all of it <laughs> because it's so amazing. Like for example, just. You know, these uh, kind of stage costumes, like, yeah, like, uh, we have a lot of them. So if you make them new, you know, these costumes are expensive. Like, they're 70, 80,000 if you make them. Because, like, we have to make stage costumes all the time. Now, if you can buy it, like, at 8,000, that's so good. Like, so I am really excited for me. I always say I will shop last, let everyone else uh, shop first. But I will see at the end of the day what is left for me and then I will buy myself and, through. And what about male collection? Male collection, yes, we do have um, a couple of donations over here. Yeah. Really cool suits were donated by a couple of celebrities. Um, we have, yeah, a lot of actors, actually, co-actors of mine have given to. They're a little shy, like, uh, to be named. Mm -hmm. But um, mostly we got, like, T-shirts and stuff from boys. But we got a couple of suits as well, so they're really, really beautiful. This is what? This is what? It's a really cool suit. It's beautiful. And uh, they're all custom made, so they're all like really high quality and beautiful fabrics. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, These are, I think, the, the costumes from movies and um, saris. We have so many beautiful things. Mm -hmm.
And uh, also, uh, I've been lots of festivals in the corner. Yeah, so perfect shopping here. We, we do have a lot of uh, festive clothing as well. So, um, you know, you can just buy yourself a new sari and uh, prepare for Diwali. You love yeah. the sari? Yeah, I love a sari. <laughs> I didn't see any kind. Uh, I have to check. <laughs> okay, uh, Evan, uh, also your upcoming movie is coming, the old movie, Amit Saan. Tell yeah. us a little about your character and what are you doing in the film? What's your character in the movie? Uh, it's a beautiful um, movie about uh, young people and uh, falling in and out of love. It's a relationship drama. It's, uh, how much can I tell you? Mm. Uh, my character is actually very close to my own character. So I love that when I play a character which becomes more easy for me to tell my story. And of course, uh, it's a lead role, so there's a lot more scope for me to perform. And um, there is always like this little comic element which I like to bring to my characters. So it's, uh, I think my character, again, like, you know, in Ye Javani, for example, uh, my character gives that lightness uh, to the movie a little bit. You know, there's drama, but there's also a little bit of, you know, comedy. And I feel like even in this movie, it's a, it's a similar kind of thing that uh, my character brings the lightness to the movie. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And uh, also, you are doing on some <coughs> album, Pakistani album, correct? Uh, yeah, I've done a, so, a song, yeah. Song. Tell yeah. Us how, how that was fun. We were shooting in Dubai. And uh, yeah, it was a very international project because so many people from different countries, Pakistan, India, Germany, mm -hmm. Dubai, Canada, UK, Scotland, like all kinds of different countries. Like the producers, everyone was from a different place. So I know people are saying it's like a Pakistan-India uh, collaboration, mm -hmm. which is true. But it's, uh, it's more of a worldwide co uh, collaboration, I would say. Yeah. And maybe I should show you the uh, our merchandise t-shirts as well? Yes. Okay. Yeah? T-shirts, yes. This is our own uh, collection. So we, this is actually a zero three. Okay? So uh, we have uh, the third garage sale. So with each garage sale we have a different number. The first one was by Rocky S. Design. The second one, uh, Kanika Goya. And this one is designed by Panarvi. She's a very... Uh, amazing t-shirt designer uh, you should check out her website panarvi.com and uh, she's famous for making uh, t-shirts from uh, organic cotton and then she uh, embellishes them they're not just printed they're also embellished I think if you see it closely it's beautiful with uh, stones and beads and everything so her whole collection is always like around these beads Beautiful, and that's uh, our new collection. Yes. Um, thank you so much. Thank you. Um, wish you all the best. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.